Hi, Deidre here from Our Upcycled Life, and today we are making a bow with no knots, no tying. This is so simple. I'm gonna show you how to do it in a couple easy steps. This is wired ribbon. It'll also work on regular ribbon, and I've cut my length of the ribbon that I want for my bow, and now I'm cutting another piece of that ribbon just a little bit smaller. And then we're going to cut one longer piece and this is going to be the tail at the bottom of the ribbon so however long you want your tail to be is how long you'll cut this piece we're going to take that longest piece of ribbon for the top and we're going to get out our hot glue gun and i'm going to glue it together into a circle Now we're gonna take our second piece of ribbon and do the exact same thing. Use a little bit of hot glue, making sure you're putting your piece that isn't the pattern or the best side on the inside when you glue it. Now we're going to take our tail and we're gonna fold it in half and we're gonna cut a piece off of the bottom in a triangle so it gives the ribbon tails a nice neat look. Now this piece is going to be what holds our bow together. So you can determine how thick you want it to be. I've cut it a little bit smaller than that second round circle and we're going to glue it together lengthwise. We're gonna take those two pieces of the ribbon, accordion fold them, and then take that piece of ribbon that we just cut, roll it around the middle, get the hot glue gun out, and glue it together. And if you have a clothespin, that would work to hold it all together until it's nice and secure. Now this is why I like using the wired ribbon because you can fiddle and you can play with it and puff it up until it looks the way that you want it to. Now we're just going to take those tails. You wanna make sure you have your two right sides facing each other, so just fold it so it does. Get a little bit of hot glue, put it on the back of your ribbon. glue it on the tail and I like to use a clothespin to hold it all together like I said so it doesn't move while it sets. That's how simple it is to create these bows with a little bit of hot glue and you don't need to tie anything. This is a little bit of a thinner ribbon. It's also wired but I'm going to do three sections in the top of the bow. Once you start making these, they're addicting and they're so beautiful and you can add them to all of your DIY projects. I also just posted a video on how to tie the perfect little bow and it's a really easy tutorial too. I like to use that method when using up scrap fabric. I'll put the link to that video down below in the description. So that's how easy it is to create beautiful bows with no knots to add to your DIY projects. Hope it was helpful. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and we'll see you in the next video. And if you love this video, I'm sure you'll love either of these next two. Take care.